Radio. Welcome to the Highest Hour, hosted by me, Cher Ferguson. I'm going to jump right into some music, um, some new music, some hot music, and we're going to get right into it. You are now tuned in, WCCR 590 AM at City College Radio. This is the Highest Hour, and I'm just going to jump right in and get to the topic of today. So, makeup versus no makeup. Should we wear makeup every day? My takes on it, I don't think so, but others may feel differently about it. Um, here today, I have a special guest, and it's Estina Munro. Hey, Estina. Hello. Hi, guys. So, Estina's just going to give me, you know, her take on, you know, what she thinks. Um, should we wear makeup every day, Estina? Honestly, I don't think you should, but always be prepared. You never right. know who you might run into. Right, 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 <laughs> right. You never know who you're going to run into. Keep it cute. Keep it cute. Um, so. For the most part, if you are experiencing like acne, you may, you know, you might want to turn to makeup, but it's never a good idea to wear makeup every day. So, um, yeah, like, we're going to start taking calls on this topic. Right now, I'm going to jump right back into the music, and we're going to get it popping in here. Hey, guys, you are now tuned in to WCCR's 590 AM radio at City College. So today, I just want to update you guys. The topic today is makeup versus no makeup. Should we wear makeup every day? And, you know, my take on it is no, we shouldn't wear makeup every day. But some people feel like we should. So right now, today, for the first time since it's my first show, I will be taking callers today. So please feel free to call in at 212-650-5962. And I would love you to answer the question, should we wear makeup every day? You know, people say no, it's like a mask, you know. Some people feel like people, females, want to sexualize themselves just by wearing makeup. And, you know, in today's day, makeup has been mainstream. And everyone is using it. Everyone is doing it. And it's basically become the new trend. So I want to hear from you guys here at WCCR. Please call in and give me a take on what do you think. Should we wear makeup every day? So you guys can call in at 212 six five zero five nine six two so estina what do you think like do you wear makeup every day absolutely not <laughs> i go to the gym so i can't wear makeup every day okay all right so, okay. going to work yes no. going to work yes so yeah, i know you like one of my closest friends but yeah. i know you love makeup I so love like, what is your take for girls that do, or people that do wear makeup every day? Like, should they or shouldn't they? And one reason why they shouldn't. Well, you shouldn't because it starts giving you, you know, discoloring on your skin. Mm -hmm. You know, breakout, stuff like that. So it's not really a good idea. Never sleep in your makeup, ever. Right. So, so that's definitely what the people need to know. Like... Definitely don't sleep in your makeup. Take care of your skin first and foremost. Natural beauty is the best beauty. So I just want to say that. Once again, we are taking phone calls on this topic. So please feel free to call in and I'll be here to answer. I'm going to dive right back into the music. I have Gucci Man featuring Migos. I get to the bag. We are now live on WCCR's 590 AM City College Radio, and this is The Hottest Hour, hosted by your girl, Cher Ferguson. Another thing, guys, you guys can check me out on my IG at The Cher Show, and also follow me on Facebook for live, full interview coverage at Cher Ferguson on Facebook. Today's topic, makeup or no makeup? Should we wear makeup every day? And I'm sitting here with the beautiful Estina Monroe, and she feels like we shouldn't wear makeup every day. I feel like we shouldn't, you know, but some people do. So we're going to just jump right in, and we're going to take a caller, and we're going to see if what they have to say and see, you know, what their takes on it is. So I'm just going to begin a song real quick and get you guys in the mood. I have Dave East and Chris Brown. Perfect. So let's get into it.
Hey guys, we're back and we are live on WCCR 590 AM City College Radio. And this is the hottest hour hosted by me, your girl, Shea Ferguson. And I still have Asina Monroe in the building. We will get to her interview in a second. But the question of today is, makeup or no makeup? Should we wear makeup every day? I have someone on the line. Are you there? Hello? 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 I guess they're not there. So, again, you guys can call in now and definitely let me know your views on should people wear makeup every day. And we are going to get right into the phone. So, let's see. Anybody calling in? Anybody calling in? Is anyone there? No. So, let's just wait and see and let's get right back to the music in a second we will be interviewing Estina on her new up and coming venture she is starting a new business and it's called Here She Goes you can catch Estina Monroe and you can follow her on Instagram at underscore damn underscore s underscore and it's just dope so you know we will be interviewing Estina in a little bit right now we are taking callers so the number again is 212-650-5962. We're going to jump right back into the music and we're going to get ready for this interview. Okay, guys, please call in if you want to give your takes on today's topic. Should we wear makeup every day? Welcome back to WCCR 590 AM radio. It's the hottest hour right now and we have someone on the line. Caller, are you there? Yes, I'm here. Hey. So Ellie, what is your how you name? doing? I'm good. What is your name and your Instagram name? Uh, Shinora. That's my name. And my Instagram name is Honeydew. Hey, Shinora, a.k.a. Honeydew on Instagram. So today's topic is makeup versus no makeup. What do you think? Like, should we wear makeup every day? Well, um, sometimes yes and sometimes no. I say, like, if you're um, in a house, and you're just, like, washing clothes, regular things, I'd be like, nah, don't wear it. But if you want to go out and sometimes wearing makeup makes feel, make women feel beautiful sometimes and just make her feel good wearing makeup. I agree so much with you. My mother will always say, like, you know, you don't want to get too dolled up every day. You want to wait till that special occasion to get dolled up and get all pretty. So why not put out the makeup when you're going out and, you know. You're right. And that out. is true. And sometimes my mom always told me you always got to keep them looking. But you don't really have to be, like, you want to, like, really, say, beat your face. It's like you going out to the club with your girls. But if you want to put, like, a little eyeliner over your face, a little mascara, you know, it's just to enhance it, not to say it enhances your face, but it gives you a little look. Like, you put, you know, you fix your face in the morning, you wash your face this morning. Right. So, that is perfect. I agree with you. Like, I really agree with you. So, like, I don't think people should wear makeup every day, but, hey, we have them girls that, or we have them guys that love makeup every day, and, you know, we're not criticizing them. We're just, you know, making a point how it's not necessary, right? Yeah, that's so true. Right. So, so true. So thank you so much, Nora, for calling in. We really appreciate you here at, you know, the hottest hour on WCCR. And I hope you keep in contact with us. Of course. Okay. Of course. I like being on the radio. <laughs> <laughs> so we're going to get right back into the next song. And I have Rockstar, you know, coming up, guys. So I'm going to put you on a brief hold. Take a listen. Thank you again, Shinora, for calling in. You are now tuned in to WCCR's 590 AM radio. This is the hottest hour with your girl, Chef Ferguson. And I have another call on the line. Are you there? Yeah, I'm here. What's going on, lady? Hey, thank you for calling in. So can you just tell me your name and your Instagram name, if you don't mind? Yeah, well, you know, I go by the same Instagram as an person. I'm Yellow Tape Doula. 
Okay, all right. Yellow tape doula, thank you for calling. So what is your take? Should we wear makeup every day? Like, in general, men, women, what do you think? Well, men don't wear makeup. <laughs> Please, so that's a, that's a no-bueno for men. But ladies, you know what I mean? It's, it's tricky with you ladies because y'all look so good with the makeup on. But then it's like the next morning after the jacuzzi, after the shower, after all the fun, it's like a whole different person the next morning. You know what I mean? It, I don't think that's fair. Understandable, and that's why everybody's just like, no. The color that I've been getting today, just like, no. You know, we shouldn't wear makeup every day because you never know the occasion. Like, you might want to just jump into that jacuzzi and get crazy. But at the same time, you know, makeup is not necessary. Is that what you're saying? I'm saying, you know, when, when you go out, it's necessary. They got waterproof makeup, mm. so you know what I mean. Like, you can still get the splish splash on. But my whole thing is just like. When is it? When 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 is it for ladies? When do y'all say I don't need the makeup? That's the whole thing. Men we enjoy the makeup, but when do you say there's no makeup? That's the whole question. Okay, well that's another question I should bring up at another time. That's a great question. Thank you, by the way. Because you gotta question yourself about different things, and you know, I feel like if you do question yourself, maybe hey, if you question, should I wear makeup today or should I not? It gives you a little purpose on what should you do. So, thank you so much for calling in, Yellow Tape. And no, definitely, no, definitely. I would just like to say that I'm, I'm, I'm also live on Facebook watching you, and you two ladies are very beautiful. I just want to add that in. Oh, thank you. <laughs> so, I just want to tell you thank you and have a great day. Thank you for calling so much. All right, Shay. All right, Athena. Thanks. Thanks. So, guys, now we're here, and... I just want to update you guys on the giveaway I did today. I gave away about 12 little Alvino lotions. Um, shout out to Face Value and Beyond on 90th Street and Broadway. They hooked us up with a whole supply of Alvino lotion. And we just want to say thank you. And again, we want to shout out Mercedes B on Instagram and on Snapchat. She works there and she is great. Um, later on, we will at the end, we will be giving out free eyelashes and we will be doing an eyelash apply inside the studio. I'm going to jump right into the music. I'm going to jump into Meek Mill's issues. And we'll be right back with Estina's interview in just a second. So, Estina, you could just tell them we'll be right back. We'll be back. Catch you guys in a second. Okay. We are here, guys. We are live on WCCR's 590 AM radio. And I think we have another call on the line. Are you there? Yes, I'm here. Hey, and what's your name and what's your social media name if you don't mind giving it to us? Um, my name is Mona. Hey, Mona. What's up, baby? Pretty one savage and on my Instagram. Instagram. Yes, I love it. <laughs> I had to get a little fresh with you. But thank you for calling in. So what does your take like on makeup versus no makeup? Should I think... Yeah, should all right. make up every day? I, I would make up when I work. Because I brought ten, so yeah, I wear makeup. But every day, no. If I'm going out, going to the store or something, no. Right. I agree. Like, I don't feel like we should wear makeup every day. And no, let your face breathe. My skin needs to breathe. First of all, and then if you have a boyfriend or something, and you laying up with him, you don't want to mess up his shirt, his sheets, leaving on your lipstick, your eyelash on his pillow. Like, come on. I agree, Mona. Like, I'm, I'm team Mona. Like, I agree with you. Like, not every day. Not every day. And I try to tell everybody, like, it's not necessary, you know? So, I really appreciate you calling today. Like, you gave me so much information I needed to, like, sum it up. Like, you were my last caller. Thank you again, Mona, so much. You're welcome. Thank you. We're going to get right back into it. Thanks again. Enjoy your day. All right. Later, ladies. Later. So we're gonna get right back into it, guys. We're gonna end, we're gonna just basically um, end this off with a quick interview with Estina. So Estina, you're still in the building. Yes, hello. So um, I wanted to just talk with you about your new business venture and just get a little take on what you're doing. So you know, what's this new business venture you're thinking about? Well, I'm currently in the process of creating my own hairline. Okay. Here she goes. Follow the Instagram. Okay. Everybody follow her Instagram. Hashtag here she goes. Hashtag here she goes. Yes. So what makes you want 
to pursue this business in cosmetic with eyelashes and hair. I've been wanting to do this since I was like 17. I was in cosmetology. Okay. There's a lot. There's okay. a lot you don't know, like, that people should know. And can you tell us, well, I know listeners are listening, can you tell us one thing um, that they should know about, you know, cosmetics? Well, don't sleep in your makeup, like I said before. Um, oh, my mic. Um, um, basically, <laughs> just don't sleep in your makeup. Right. That's key. Like, anything else, like, keep your hair done, that's it. Okay, okay. Cute. Okay. That was the music. <laughs> <laughs> but hey, why not? It's the first show. Why can't it be like this? Yeah. So my last question for you is like, what do you? What are some of your goals for your company, your brand new company? Well, one, I wanna you know like have my own website. I need models, so keep that in mind, ladies. Um, I want a store eventually, and. When I become even bigger, I want to own my own salon. I don't want to be the one working, so I just want to direct everything. I don't want to do hair. I do hair, but I don't like to do it. So that's the reason why you want to pursue owning yeah, I wanna, the business. Uh, yeah, like, exactly. Working for the business. And I so that one of your goals is basically to just open up your store for yeah, a salon. Right. A few of them. And how long do you think you'll do that with this new business venture? What do you mean, how long will it take? Yeah, like how long will it take? Well, I'm giving myself at least five years. So, okay. I'm gonna start that is not a bad idea and you know i think that that's a great idea starting out with a new business you know you take your time with it you know gather up all your details um estina went to school so i definitely want to promote education i got my business cards with me yes <laughs> so we will be um handing out her business cards to all listeners i hope they're in, you know listening in and we will be right back here doing a little Facebook, you know, live with eyelashes, guys, for our topic today. So we're going to jump right back into the music. We're going to get you guys ready for the end of this beautiful show. And we will be right back with some dope hits.